It's a new dawn. Oh. It's actually a new day. It might not look like it, but it's four o'clock in the morning, and we are currently. Mm -hmm. It's four o'clock in the morning. And it's starting to get light. Ooh. And Mark is currently making our bed for the night. Look. Looks very cozy. I'm not letting it all out this time, bro. Yeah, please don't do that. I have to kind of like upload my vlogs oh my to Byron God. to edit this together on my phone. So hopefully I can get that done. If I don't, then Bob's your uncle. Don't Finds your aunt. There's no vlog. Ta da. Oh, yeah. Also, if it, it does upload, then wow, that's amazing. Byron, you're a legend, and uh, I hope it worked. My phone's most likely going to die in the night though so let's see how things goes and then also that said i will see you guys in approximately five hours when the next train drives past this track and wakes us up bye now oh here we are here, here we are welcome to our five-star bedroom we have a dewalt charger kit use it as a torch this is a sweet window oh we can't open windows because the alarm's on just think like we didn't know we were doing this with a few oh, days no. in it. wait does it actually work no because the alarm ah! oh my god so we did know actually in advance that we could have Legitimately just booked a hotel or something, but oh, there's nothing mate. better than a bonding experience. Are you comfy? It's comfy, mate. Oh my god, it's actually. <laughs> it's comfy as fuck. Turn your torch off. <laughs> Alright, guys, we'll see you in the morning. That's <laughs> adios! That's <laughs> adios! Oh my god. 9 a.m. Steam train. Morning, Mark. Morning. Oh my god. Oh, morning. Good night sleep. Good night, goddamn sleep. Yep. Just not enough of it. We came in, went to bed at like 3 o'clock ish. It's now nine o'clock ish, so. Oh, kind of the train. He's going checking it out. There you go. <laughs> we got a right view here. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, sir. <laughs> Did he wave? Hello. <laughs> he waved, yeah. Mark's absolutely buzzing. <laughs> Quite literally. I like trains. MTV Cribs, welcome to my ride. We got the front, <laughs> we got the back. <laughs> All right, successful night's sleep was successful. Might not look like it, but I did actually change my clothes. Got fully naked here and I'm absolutely rocking and rolling. But even though we have this camper van right here, one rule of camper vans is you don't take a poo in the camper van, so I'm going to the toilet. How's breakfast looking? Bacon's coming on nicely. Tell me in the back of the BMW. Yeah, to be fair, <laughs> my dad was bringing us cups of like tea and coffee in the back of the BMW, which was awesome. But um, I'm going to get, um, not quite sure where this guy's going because it's a dead end. Yeah, that didn't last too long. Anyway, right, so I'm going to go to use the bathroom. But that was actually a pretty good night's sleep. We did get in at like 4 a.m. and we woke up at like 9 o'clock because that train woke us up. But uh, just another day in the life of Tom where we slummed it out at the back of a car. And now we are currently in Whitby Harbour. You can see the uh, ocean has gone down. You might be like, that doesn't look like the ocean. Well, trust me, it is, because that's the sea over there. What a night last night. Got in at like 4 a.m. Woke up by a train like that. But I tell you what, you can't knock it. Got woken up to my dad bringing me a cup of, cup of tea of sugar. And he's making us a bacon butty. Perfect. Not bad, Ken. Not bad. Made us a bacon butty. Not a bad start to the day. Mm. We just had a bacon butty, but come on. An ice cream parlor? Oh, I'm so down to mess with this. Bro, Whitby's booming. Where the spoons where we were last night, absolutely ran a land. Freaking hell, everyone's come to town. Ken, what's the plan? Go to the beach. Looking for beach corvid, fossils. Looking for fossils. In Whitby. So this goes. Hey, I wasn't expecting to see this in Whitby. <laughs> um, yeah, I've got a feeling they're not locals. <laughs> yeah. Just saying that right now. Oh yeah, Barry. Oh yeah, Barry. I don't actually think he's playing. I, I'm, I'm serious. I don't think he's playing it because I'm sure that's like a soundtrack from Kill Bill. Oh, wow. Oh my lord. Yeah, I know, right? Oh yeah, my lord. A toy map. I have to go in, I'm sorry. This is like my childhood. We are currently making our way through the Victorian streets of Whiteby. There'll be a lot of tourists, and I'm like actually not being racist or anything like that. Like we've seen Americans, like by the sounds of it, Chinese. Yep. I like how my I'm pointing out like cultural stuff, and then my dad's like, good pub, but. Alcohol always on the brain. Yeah, you definitely ain't getting that now. <laughs> oh, God. The famous 199 steps. Why would you not just do one more? You know what I mean? Look. Oh. It says, there's a sign that says 199, and it goes all the way up. Oh yeah, look at that. Proper seaside there right now. Nice and fresh. I like how them two have gone away looking for fossils. Oh, they had to just come here. Look at this, 100%. No, no joke, we're actually looking for fossils because apparently there's loads in this like cliff edge. And you can just like see them on the side or like dig them out or something, but I didn't really come equipped shoe-wise. Lots of water. Breathable shoes. We can do this. Welcome to beach combing with Tom. 
We are currently fighting the tide as it's coming in and it will block our exit. We could say we could climb out, but that's a pretty big, steep hill. I'm going to go and get closer to Mark and Ken and drink my own piss. This is how to mount it. Oh my, okay, okay, okay. There is no grip on these shoes in the slightest, so um, I'm going to put my phone away. That well looks like a fossil hole, doesn't it? Yeah, this looks pretty dangerous. Well dangerous. Wait, are we agreeing this is dangerous? Yeah, it's slow to shoot this one than I have. Hmm, hmm. Let's at least find one fossil and then go. Hunt it. Whoa! Sprinkle it. Wow! How many millions of years do you think this is old? Millions and millions I, of years. I've seen movies where you take the smallest one from the bottom and they all fall, so let's not do this. <laughs> it's actually hella satisfying. Oh my god, that's so satisfying. That's like that, uh. This is some like ASMR physical though. What have you found? What have you found? Oh! Whoa, what have you found? I don't know what it is. He's found a tool! This is mental, look how it just peels away. Whoa, whoa! Tom, see this? Careful. Yeah, no, this is dangerous. See that? I just picked it out of there. Google fossils. Yeah, no, no. And you'll see a fossil. That is a fossil, mate. And it'll tell you what it's about. Really? Yeah. That's yeah. that's so an old. This. This is that does look like a tooth or something. Yeah, no, that, that is. Out. Wow. Unless that's Whitby Jet. No. Look, look, look. No, it looks like glass, doesn't it? It's too yeah. soft. Mm. I like on the fossil hunt. They two have found something. I haven't yet found anything. So just give me a minute. Careful. Before uh, honestly, up there. Oh, be fine. See the original hat. Just a disclaimer, does not keep you safe from rock falls, but in this case it does. Fossil hunting boys, look at that, we actually found something. Whoa! Oh my god, that scared the hell out of me. I thought it was all gonna start crumbling. Just pick that one out. That looks like a rock. Millions that... of years old, that mate. No, no, I believe, I believe, I'm not questioning you. I'm just saying that looks like a rock and that actually looks like something. Just pulled this out the wall. What is it? Why is it circular? Somebody explain. Right now, it seems like the tide is coming in. I don't know why my accent's gone a bit Australianish the down under. The tide has indeed come in. We can see a native drawing emojis on the beach. It looks like they're asking for help via a smiley face. But the beach is disappearing. The sea is coming closer and our escape path is getting smaller. I'm Bear Tom and this it's beach survival. Just saying, that's pretty cool. Look at the rock formation. All the little lines of how the years have just grown and grown and grown and grown and grown. We're just little ants on this huge planet with rock protruding from magma deep below the surface. Look, no joke, I've been digging here, digging here. Look, a fossil. I've actually found a fossil. Whoa, it's tiny, but I found one. Look, I actually that's found it, yeah. a fossil. Yeah. No way. These, I, I think these are uh, shells. The shells that have been crushed into the side of the surface all this time, but that's actually a fossil. Oh, did you find one? Am I, am I the only person who's found I, a fossil? No, I, no uh, this is the first fossil here I've got. Yeah, so you've got that, but you haven't got the pattern on it. Do you know what I mean? Like yeah, that. No, no, it's yeah. a different type of fossil, that one there, you see. Right? And, and, and some I think they call Google, I can't remember the name of it. We got that. Come on now. Look around you. Come on now. Oh, How'd you come? Come, come. It's so delicate. I know, I'm trying not to like this. Oh, wait. Oh, it, this might come off in one, actually. I'm like, off the yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, need I need workspace! Like they do in the movies. Like they do in the movies. Come on. Oh, it's there. Oh, I got it! Whoa! Your boy found a fossil! Get on my level! Whoa! What have you got? Fossil! Sweet. Right? It's very brittle. Careful! Very, very brittle. Nice! I'm, a, I'm an official fossil finder. Stone. Oh. Oh, that's a shame. I actually found a fossil. Nice. Yeah, he's got the right idea. He's, you can definitely tell he's grown up with a YouTube because it's like, yes, we could escape the tide and like crawl out. Oh, we could theory. get trapped and then get rescued by a boat or a helicopter. Help us! Help us! Uh, trapped on the beach. Ah! But that would be wasting their time and we're not going to do that. So we've got a schedule let's, to stay. Yeah, let's go. Well, I beat them. I just don't know where they are. <laughs> Dad? <laughs> Mark? Hello there. They're trying to work out a way to get past the water. I was like, how about don't go there? How about go all the way around? That's what I did, so that, they, they'll learn from me one day. There you go, you sausages. That's a success. Found myself a fossil. Don't mind if I do. Them two are still alive. All's good. And let me just say this right now. You know, I'm talking about like having anxiety. This iPhone is the slippiest thing to hold in the world. All I could think about was dropping my phone down between the rocks. So imagine dropping your phone down there. You ain't ever getting that back. If you would have done it, I'd have been so proud of you as a brother. 12 months ago, where were we? Brett Ventura Twice jumping off one yeah, like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, then. 20 quid, jump in it. We didn't need to be paid, did we? God damn it. Off. If it was actually nice weather, 
like sunny sunny, I'd jump in that. <laughs> well, if I can see as far as the seaweed's going down, I think you could jump in that. All right, listen, Bob's your uncle, finish it Broken leg, easy, boom, fixed. Beat you to the top, boy. Whoa, very old and very cool. I'm not good. I'm absolutely not good. Our history is pretty cool, even if you're not religious. It is very, very cool. Whoa, look at the steam train going out. It's like a model railway set, this is beautiful and a little horsey here as well. Gorgeous. 199 steps later, I walked through a graveyard, we've made it to our destination. Hey, check this out! Look at Last time we came it was just that tiny shop, no it's an entire little Concorde. Well I don't think that's called a Concorde or whatever, but yeah it's expanded, this is this is mega cool. That's a buddy, in it to lead you to pubs? Aren't they pubs? And it shows you the route of where to go to get to the next bar. <laughs> that's mint. Uh, to a new dawn, to a new day. Been a good one. For round two, round two, and to, to round twelve for Anthony Joshua. Fight's going on tonight, so we're gonna try and find a pub and watch it. So, my club brewery. Be oh, thingy! One beer down. We're now gonna make our way into town. See how it rounds, more wizard. Uh, we're gonna make our way down into town, see what's going on down there, try and get some grubber scrub, more beers, and town and watch the fight, which I think might be at like eleven o'clock. So it's only one beer. So we've got quite a while to kill, so drink your time. From all the way up here, 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 where am I from? Yorkshire. We just said chuck, 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 chuck. And look, it's, wait, can we hear them windpipe people yeah, from here? Are you kidding me? Windpipes up here. I'm trying to look at the train coming in and all I can hear is those, those pipe players playing some bloody Kill Bill theme tune down there. Please, what split one with me. I want that one. That one. That one. I'll get you that one. Really? Oh, you're the best brother ever. <laughs> I'd love to say I'm really happy right now, but I ended up paying for it. They didn't take card. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> Jokers. Okay. Hey, Whitby's booming. Whitby's, look at it. Booming. There's a pirate there. And then we look in the shop here. Nazi memorabilia. What the heck? After all the shops we've seen so far, I wasn't expecting to find a hipster store with beard oil. Mm. Ken's warming up by the fire. But then in the back, we've got a bloody barbers. That's so cool. Out of this cupboard, what did I use to collect? What did I use to collect, Ken? James Bond cars. James Bond corgi cars. Uh, don't have it, don't have it. Got collection starts great, but I've definitely got this one here in the middle because that was my favourite. I've got that one there. I've got this one here, but obviously part of that collection. Any else? Nope. Oh, I think I have the space shuttle as well. Oh, mate. Oh, there it is. Oh. That's the exact one I was talking about. I've got the Aston Martin Vanquish, and then I've got the DB5. The XKR. Oh, it's a, it's a Jaguar. I didn't even bloody notice. Hell yeah. I've always wanted to come into a fossil shop and look at, you know, like dinosaur bones and all that sort of stuff. Big megalodon teeth. It looks amazing. Like, look at this. Look at the detail. But do you know what's more impressive than this detail? Reptile poo. Mm hmm. Not even joking. Fossilized reptile poo. Mm. Crabbing. It's not fishing, but it's crabbing. Basically, throw a line out with like a bag with like food in it, like meat or something, and the crabs get attracted to the bag and you basically pull them up. So, for example, look at everyone absolutely killing the game right now, and it does work because look how many they've caught. Wait, look how many crabs are in that bucket. Absolutely, and they're massive as well. These are huge crabs. Bit of a weird. Have they got another one? Bit of a weird sort of. Uh... Past Sport time. or past, yeah, pastime. <laughs> I, I definitely can say so, but I tell you what, it is fun. Surprise, surprise, look where you are. Hmm. Oh, what the I'll take a water, please. You're paying. Uh, whoa. <laughs> nope, nope. Guy just asked for a shout out and then walks away. Well, Max, wait, where is he? There he is. There he is. There he is. <laughs> Hey, he wanted a shout-out. He asked for a shout-out and walked away. I don't usually give him to anyone, but he seems like a nice lad. So, Max, if you're watching this, nice to meet you, bro. Look at this. <laughs> Absolutely booming. What, Lee just in a boat going down? <laughs> Hi, Lee. We were supposed to be going in a boat today, like a, an inflatable dinghy down the thing, but plans changed. Dad fell over. And look, wait, wait, shut, wait. Look how swollen this hand is compared to that one. Mate, on camera, that's insane. Oh, it is insane. Does it hurt? Massive. Uh oh. Uh, drama. Quite creative until you do this. See? Ruined. I was gonna get that. That looks pretty good, but oh my gosh. What's this? That is a proper fish and chips, that in it robbed. Thank you. <coughs> uh, it just tastes like potato. What chip <laughs> that? I know, <laughs> yeah. but does it taste like a fish Where and chip? Where were you roll? Oh, like it. oh. That's weird. Food of champions. Boom. What a change in scenery. We weren't expecting this, were you? Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, 
I was, to be fair, yeah. I wasn't expecting that response to be quite oh, fair. What? Missing what do you think you'll drag you here? Because you're a dick. Chasing the sun, mate. <laughs> nah, I wouldn't miss another Whitby trip. I would not sun. miss another Whitby trip, ever. <laughs> every, time we come to, every time we come to Whitby, we have some sort of uh, summer to talk about. Adventure, <laughs> yeah. yeah, let's just say that. Drink in the sun, kicking back. Let's hope these clouds bugger off sometime soon and we'll be absolutely set. Mark's sorting out the bill and I'm getting a suntan. Ken, what have you done now? What have you done? What's been nicked? What's been had off? Two police vans outside like this. Oh my bloody god. All right. Right. There's a thumbnail here, I'm sure. There's an absolute thumbnail. I am the captain now. That is a big ass bird, right? Hey, go and get, go get a number. Go get a number. Go get a number. Hello. Cation ended up with us in the hospital. I'm looking for the cut. Minor injuries. Yeah, have you got anything wrong with you? Well, my knee hurts a bit. <laughs> Ken, did you expect this family holiday to end up in the uh, hospital? Oh, it's, it's, it's a fucking thing. <laughs> yeah, Th wait, we need a thumbnail here. Come on, let's, hang on a minute, where are we going? The Sexual Health Podiatry AIPT. Yeah. Oh, so, oh, is that you posing for a thumbnail? <laughs> nice. Oh, hell yeah, this is gonna be service and a half. I've never been to a hospital with no one in it. I'm just gonna get your uh, posing for thumbnails on, on video. Yep, I got it. Yeah, I did get it. He always thinks he's dead funny, like, you'll never see this. And then I catch it on camera. Giving blood gone viral. <laughs> get it? Gone viral? Okay. There's legitimately no hospital in the world that's quieter than this. Can we just cruise? Yeah. What? Welcome to Whitby Minor Injuries. <laughs> Waiting time is up to one second. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, I'll tell you what you could do. You know, like those, you know those overnight like challenges to stay somewhere. Yeah, yeah. Guarantee you could pull this off here. Just hide under a chair just or something. Turn all the lights off. We're exploring the old hotel. Well, there is, there is these security cameras. Yeah. Wait, it's like them security cameras in the movies where you just, you know, you unplug <laughs> it from the back and they just never know. <laughs> Like, I'll just move it does it even, mate, that's an, oh, that, that's a VHS security camera, it doesn't even work. He's watching the disabled toilets. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get a shot. Mate, I'm gonna, I'm gonna title this video, Exploring, Ab <laughs> Exploring Abandoned Hospital. Oh, that's scary. No wonder the NHS is skin, it's just paying for f***ing lights on a hospital. <laughs> <laughs> it's worse than my house, the amount of lights that are on. Well, there's nothing to do here, so they've set themselves up a communal garden. Wow. Where well, they execute pigeons, by the looks of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's some really messed up <laughs> scene right there. Bloody hell! What the hell's going on around here? Seagulls and a Okay. Oh, wait, x ray and radiology. That's well, do you Yeah, well, do. There's no way it's open. No, is it? Wait, wait, wait. Saturday. Don't, please. Saturday. Okay, at least you follow the rules and lock Saturday the doors. Saturday, yeah, don't really want. Please, please knock. <laughs> Imagine if it knocked back. Ghosts. Cruising in a hospital. If we can somehow find a hospital gown, I'm defo putting it on. So, like, <laughs> straight chair, fact. Chair, yeah, straight fact. I, I, like, I'm not, I'm not trying to be a dick. We're not wasting anyone's time, but if I can find a gown, 100% putting it on. I don't want to go in there. Oh, mate, this is hella haunted. But what's in this room? You don't get in there, what? That's locked. And that's locked. Whew. I thought our, I thought our hearted adventure was about to continue. I'm not going There's a war memorial ward. Wait, 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 wait. Multi grave? Oh no, sorry, multi sorry. <laughs> multi grave. That's where they just throw the dead people in. Same a bit. Uh, well we're here. Where are you going? Third floor. Oh. Yes. Yeah, you going oh, you bastard. Mmm. <laughs> Healthy hospital, there's just a fly crawling along the wall. Oh, you, would been, you, would have been good, you would have been good in the army, you can't even, can't even flick a fly. Um, yeah, no, come back to that. I've wanted to say, I think this ward has more life to it. Oh, there's a map. Oh my God, I feel like this is like Resident Evil. Okay, you are here. Bye now. Bye now. <laughs> Bye now. I am not gonna go into the war memorial ward. Like, no thank you, I think that's a bit rude and disrespectful. I'm just gonna wait apparently 15 minutes for this elevator to come back up. Probably quicker to take the stairs, and we're gonna go and see how Ken's doing. I tell you what, I think it's actually quicker for me to take the stairs. I'm t yeah, I'm taking the stairs. Authorised staff only. Yep, not doing that. Yeah, it's only, oh my god, oh, I've got all the way to the ground floor. Oh, the elevator. Oh, this place is haunted. Hello there, Mark boy. Hello there. What? Uh, it's too slow. Did you press every button? You are a bastard. 
Definitely, I could trust him. You think you fractured it? I've got another belt. What? Oh, Ken. The ideal situation here would be hey, we can come back tomorrow and get an x-ray. Instead, the woman was like, I can do you one better. You can drive 30 minutes away to another hospital and get an x-ray. So, um, unfortunately, we now have to go to Scarborough. We have to go to Scarborough to get my dad an x-ray on his hand. An adventure in the day in the life of Tom. That's my theme tune. <sighs> It's just never simple, is it? Like, it, it never is. It's like, go on holiday to Florida. Lose passport, has to get emergency passport. Sweet, goes on the family trip, family falls out. <laughs> Dad breaks hand, have to go to the hospital. A day in the life of Tom. 30 minutes later, we made it to Scarborough and the sky is gorgeous. That is absolutely stunning. If you don't drive a white car here, you are kind of strange, because holy crap, that's a lot. Yeah, it's quite specific in Scarborough, just saying. Next stop, emergency department. Like, if you ever need to go to the doctors, just always go to the doctors, like, on the East Coast. No one here. Fratch Clinic? Yes? Yes, yes, yes. We lied when we said it was empty. It's absolutely <laughs> What do I reckon about it being extremely busy? Ken Castle. Not about this right now. Oh, Ken Castle. Oh, not about this in the slightest. They said it's like a minimum one hour wait, one hour wait for him to get assessed again. And then it can be up to three hours. And that's without him even getting the x-ray or like a plaster put on. Oh boy. Sorry, you feel like a what? Like a what? Like a wimp. Gonna be belt that now. <laughs> oh my arm is broken. Don't touch it. And my thumb's broken. Yeah. At least you're okay. That's all that well, matters. Well, you think all that blueness and that swelling is from nothing wrong? You know what I mean? It's like something wrong. But you just bruised it and you couldn't. Way. You couldn't handle the pain. You wimp. What else could I say? Two hours later, we exit. Oh my god. We're parked up and ready to go. And my dad is trying to he's trying to wedge the camper out, but this crank has parked so close that he's gonna have to do like a 30 point turn to get it on the right angle and then back it out. Pretty brutal. Oh, he's so close. Jesus, that was close. I've always said to my dad, he's an incredible driver. He really, really is. To maneuver a van like this, he's drove vans his entire life as a builder, but he's incredible, man. He's absolutely incredible. <laughs> I say that and watch, watch him come up this now and the van goes, Poof. oh, he's nowhere near that car, mate. He's absolutely nowhere near it. Whoa, no, 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 watch the back. Uh, just like that, we're out of there. Done. Well, we say that, fingers crossed. I'm getting in the car freezing. All right, nice one. See you later, Lee. So, so good, See you later, Mark. Drive safe till the next, uh, the next five star retreat, eh? It's been mid, thanks for the bed. <laughs> thanks for being my little spoon. <laughs> oh, yeah, with our, with how everything's panned out with Dad's hand and all that, it's just easier for us to just say, you know what, we're gonna sack it, get off home, and uh, Dad can just rest back home. So, that's the plan. We're going home. No, it says, Animals in road slow, doing 20 on a 70 mile per hour road. Are you kidding me? I've never read animals in road before. Uh, 11 o'clock at night and seeing traffic like this on this motorway, and we're about 45 minutes away from home, is not good. Something has gone down, and I do not think it was animals in the road. These like... <laughs> I was just about to say, these guys are absolutely raving the tits off because the van's bouncing, and they're out on the freaking motorway. <laughs> <laughs> that is legendary. <laughs> oh, mate, you guys are absolutely mental. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. These guys are going, oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> mate, I just ran over to them and was like, cheers, lads. They all came running towards us, cheers, my beer. And they, they are just going on an absolute madden. I would not be surprised now because they're throwing cans everywhere. I would not be surprised. If the cops come up, I'm not joking. There's even more of them, and they've bent that guy's window back by accident. Oh my oh, god. This guy just popped the back door then. Ooh. Popped the back door and he <laughs> popped out with a street cone. Oh my god. Oh mate, legends. I told I told them that <laughs> yeah. they smacked the wind mirror. Yeah, they went back and now. fixed it. Think, oh, it's moving. It's moving. We're going. We're going. We're, we're going. All right. We've got a roadblock. In back we go. Jesus. What on earth? It just says do not pass. What's he doing? Wait, what are you doing? Uh I'm honestly not sure. <coughs> Just says do not pass, and then that looks like a cop car there. Yes. Yeah, have they have they got someone pinned down? Are, are they escorting someone? Is it is that someone walking? What's that? Yeah, there's two cops. They're walking. It was a pony. It was a pony. 
No way! Yeah. It's a fucking pony! Yeah. How did a pony get on the motorway? Uh -huh. What? I hope I got that on camera. Sorry, I got so distracted. Um, done. Home sweet home. Steve, I'm home, buddy. Don't worry. You don't have to survive off the six crickets in the space of 48 hours, but we're back. We've done it. Brutal journey. A hilarious journey, I'm not going to lie. Uh, I was supposed to be going meeting up with the lads. Like, everyone was supposed to be out drinking and all this sort of stuff. But my goddaughter's birthday tomorrow, which I'm going to, like, the birthday party for her. She's turned two. She's adorable. We're all supposed to be, like, out tonight, like, drinking, drinking. And, like, everyone's gone home, apart from two people. So I'm just a bit, like... I like how my phone cut off then, because I was like, I'm not sure if it's worth going out drinking. And then my mates rang me to be like, what are you doing? So I'm going to go and just take this phone call real quick. One second. Well, I can definitely say this, Dad. I've had a really good time. <laughs> we definitely made the most of it. It is a bit of a shame it panned out the way it did, but yeah. nonetheless, still a lot of fun. Yeah. Hey, and the good thing is, yeah. not a broken wrist. Ah, oh, yeah, that's <laughs> There's the silver lining right there. Ended up with a result. No plaster on. Yeah, that, that, that is bandage, the, uh, the bandage is off. That's the win right there. Oh, do, you, do you feel like you're not loved? Oh, do you feel like you're loved. not loved? I'm Why? like um, an RSPC. Oh, yeah, but I'm, I'm drinking out of a, a chalice. Well, to be fair, it's a, a football cup chalice, but it's got wine in it. Thank you. Cheers. To good health, to happiness, and to finally getting out for once. We would never mix random, what's that called? Mind sweeping. We'd never mind sweep the drinks. This is just the bottles that were left. Can imagine, yeah. Are you going to drink that instead? Take me. Come on. Where are the straws? Jesus, what have I What the job? Hey, Wes, Becky. Come on. Right, shall I stir it? Are you having some? Mix it in. Anyone else? She's like, this looks like a one. Wait, I'm making, I don't think they're drinking it. Oh, it's nice. Anyone else? Charlie, on. Charlie, come on. Yeah, come on. Charlie. Come on. You look like you love a good drink. That was cool. an okay yeah, time. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. That's really good. Yeah. Oh, sorry. You made a clip record out, yeah? I'm already recording. It's not like I've done this shit for a job. I like it better than that. Quick. If I wasn't getting drunk in Whitby, I'm getting drunk with the boys. Pull your dick out. What? Steven! No penises line. will be oh, yeah, made yeah, yeah. public in this establishment. Oh, I, okay. I apologise, penis. I am going to be sick. Oh, you know what? <laughs> that is hella nasty. Ooh, what is that? Is it Pino? And Pino blush. Do you know what? I didn't drink any of that. Nope. Just for the record, I'm holding you to it. What are you doing? Right, do you need picking up for a party tomorrow? What, past 12? <laughs> yes. It's on camera now. Yes. Right, what past 12? I'll be outside your house. Oh, is it party games? Yeah. Are we getting drunk? It's a t no, it's a two-year-old yeah, party. But he said he's drinking. No. Musical chairs, for Christ's sake, it's man. A two-year-old does not know how to play musical chairs. I Let alone know my f***ing dirt. All right, you yeah. right. yeah. f***ing burst you. <laughs> Boom! Okay, first of all, this is not poo on my hands for everyone saying like, what's on Tom's hands? It's henna tattoo. It's not a real tattoo, but it's henna. Uh, it's basically ink. It dyes your hands for like two weeks. But I am outside. It is a new dawn. It is a new day. In tomorrow's vlog, I'm going to tell you guys a story of how Wes basically mm, owned the living shit out of someone by RKOing them over his head onto the floor and basically knocked them out. Like, actually, it was like a fight. So I'm going to tell you about that in tomorrow's vlog, but I have to end this now because when I ended yesterday's vlog, I was like, cool, it all kicked off and you guys didn't see any of it. So I'm sorry that I didn't get it on camera. If I get any CCTV footage of it, I will definitely show you, but I have to end today's vlog. Make sure you leave a like, grain, subscribe. I'll see you tomorrow at 6 p.m. for the next day vlog. So until then, much love to your face and asa. Do you? Hoss.